How close are Prince William and Kate Middleton to Rose Hanbury? Arguments can continually be made about the validity of living close to relatives or friends when things can sometimes go awry. Maybe this isn't a problem as much if you are not a royal with scrutiny placed on your shoulders every day. When placed in context of William and Kate, they've apparently learned this through trial and error. The recent rumor about William possibly having an affair with their close friend, Rose Hanbury, just doesn't seem to want to go away. Despite being purely speculative at the moment, it's a much bigger deal in Britain. One reason is Hanbury was a close figure to the family, including historical connections. What really went wrong here? Or is there anything wrong at all? Rose Hanbury was well respected within royal circles. Known as the Marchioness of Colmendalee, due to marrying the seventh Marquess of Colmendalee, David Roxovich. Hanbury had been very active socially within royal confines. Even if her title isn't up to the level of a duchess or a princess, she's been respected and allowed to attend many royal functions. Before taking on this life, she was once a model and also worked as a political researcher for a conservative MP. It was ten years ago when she married Roxovich, changing her life into being a noble woman in the British upper class. Connections to the Windsors are a bit interesting and makes you wonder if William realized how close of a connection they really had. This comes from Hanbury's grandmother being a bridesmaid at Queen Elizabeth's wedding to Prince Philip 72 years ago. Now you see how William and Kate became friends with Hanbury beyond just living in the same vicinity. Did Kate really have any say in befriending Hanbury and Droxovich? Beyond the family connections, the similarities between Hanbury and William and Kate are eerily parallel. Hanbury had three kids with Roxovich, exactly like Kate. They've also lived close by in a major estate and created a secret aristocratic community known as the Turnip Toffs. Having a clandestine group like this where you spend significant time together is bound to create a little friction. After all, it seems they were always seen together partaking in activities which maybe meant finding out things about one another they regretted. We do know Hanbury was seen at the wedding of William and Kate in 2011. They've basically known one another for eight years, giving plenty of time for Kate to perhaps learn things she didn't want to know. Having them this close was also likely by decree of William, with Kate acquiescing. Are the rumors just the British press trying to pester the royals? While evidence is out there proving how close William and Kate were to Rose Hanbury, the British press are sort of waging war with the royals due to William and Harry's long-standing hatred of the paparazzi. Is it possible the UK media are taking hearsay information and blowing it up into a story of William having an affair with Rose? William has already denied it vehemently when supposedly confronted by Kate. Then again, many gossip sites have contended William has always had secret feelings for Hanbury and felt she was the one who got away. Was it simple flirting taken by the press and inflated into an untrue scandal? We'll likely never know the truth. When looked at from the media side and the royal side, the truth will likely never be known in total and just rumored over for years. Only if Rose Hanbury ever divorces and writes a tell-all book will we really know. Considering the British media obscures royal truth, plus the royals being crafty on diversions, expect nothing more out of it in the meantime. More official sources say the friendships among Hanbury, Roxovich and William, Kate haven't been damaged at all with each perplexed over the scandal. If so, it shows the royals are living in another dimension of truth outsiders will never be able to see through in our lifetimes.